I did not know, I was not aware that the Food and Drug Administration in the United States went into areas that they needed to pack heat, you know, coming yes. blazing with their guns. Oh yes, Charlie, they, that's what they're doing. And I entitled this Raw Milk and Other Health Criminals, question mark. Because would, would you believe that a, that a raw milk producer is, is that they'll bring in guns and say, you're going to shut you down, this is terrible, you can't transport your raw milk. And, then, and then these people that, that produce really good health products, they can't, they can't say that it does good for the health. But food gives you health. Food can fight disease, but you can't say it. Cherries are good, but cherries can't be said to be a health thing anymore because then you become a drug, you see. Well, that's because the great big pharma wants to protect their witchcraft pharmacies. They want to say this is, this is Satan's way to produce healing. Jesus' way is to heal them by his stripes. But the world wants to receive healing by the, the drugs. And they'll say, well, there's this, these uh, you know, side effects are great. They'll say, well, this drug is good for you and help you here. But pay attention that you may have, let's say, sore throat. You may have problems with your head. It may give you headaches. It may give you stomach ache. It may have shortness of breath. And you may die suddenly. Yeah. <laughs> so why would you but, want to take it? But ask your doctor if it's good for you. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Some of these commercials are rather funny. But it's not funny what they're doing to even Christians who are keeping... You know, have have health food stores. They will come and they will they will attack with guns and say you need to you know stop this stuff. This is illegal. Well, there's nothing illegal about it. It's simply that FDA is taking on a dictatorial uh, position, and we we come against that. It's not of God. And if you're a believer, trust in Jesus to protect you because this is not God's way to stop. God wants us to protect our temples and to eat what is good. We we encourage you to eat what is good and to stay healthy in Jesus' name.